Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to The Witcher 3. We are back here once again on uh, Skellige. Um So we're still going to carry on uh, exploring. We're making our uh, making our way east towards Uriala Harbour at the moment, since it's the only one of the major islands in Skellige which we've still not actually been on, despite all the time that we've actually been here in Skellige. Um, so I'm quite intrigued as to what exactly we'll find there, but we shall find out soon enough. For now, we shall carry on our sailing and looting. And perhaps we shall stumble across a quest or two on the way there as well. Uh, like we did at the island in uh, the last episode where we um, bought a goddamn arch griffin. Which, not gonna lie, wouldn't recommend it. It's not fun. Right, so we will leave this port and go inland and there's a shit ton of drowned dead here what do we got no you ain't you ain't hitting me no 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 nope nope ow okay one of you hit me one of you hit me fair enough I respect that I I also respect the fact that you were cut in half and still tried your utmost to stay upright. Just didn't quite work out for you. Right. Nice, nice, nice. Bit more loot for us there. Bit more loot and a nice little colony of drowners dealt with. Let's hop up here. And, uh, right. So we've got this little inlet of this island here, which looks quite, which looks like it could be quite an interesting one. There might be something tucked away there. Something mysterious. Or it could be some just another smuggler's cache, which is way more inland than what it actually should be. Uh, don't know. Don't know. Well, I can definitely see sirens. That's that's a fact. So it probably is a smuggler's cache. Can I hang your head from my saddle? No, you're not, Geralt. You, you 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 already have a trophy. You don't need any more. That one's guarded treasure. Right, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna leave my boat there. I'm just gonna swim because I don't feel like taking the boat in this tiny little tiny little inlet here is gonna end well. I feel like we're definitely going to end up just smashing into a rock. Right. Shrim, 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 shrim. And the hop. Okay, so that wasn't as exciting as what I hoped it might be, but we, you know what? We move on. We move on. We have another island to check out. I mean, it's, let's be honest, it's Skellige. There's always more islands to check out. There's very rarely a point where you're gonna where you're gonna get to an island that that doesn't have something on it. It's, uh, it's, it's very constant. Not gonna lie, I thought a whale was gonna actually pop up right under our boat there, with, with the way the water kind of splashed up. Thankfully it didn't, because I don't even want to imagine what would have happened to the boat if, if that happened. I feel, I, I feel like the boat would have either capsized, or it could have potentially had a mess up with the physics and just got launched and just got launched into space. Sort of Skyrim giant style, you know? Oh my god, Geralt can. Geralt cannot hit this this echidna to say right. Geralt, are you alright? 
Why can't you just hit the echidna girl? It's thank you. It was so it was right in front of you. You madman. You absolute madman. Some nice gauntlets. More knights gauntlets. How many knights drowned here? We'll never know. Well, it's, it's, it's the smugglers' cash, so we we'll probably can't say they drowned. But how many knights are involved in smuggling? We don't know. I wouldn't trust most uh, most knights in this game, to be honest. In terms of like most of the organizations they serve, like. Like the Knights of the Order, the, the Knights of the Order of the Flaming Rose, for example, wouldn't trust, wouldn't trust them. Knights of the Eternal Fire, no. I mean that basically is the Order of the Flaming Rose, but you know, you get what I mean. All knights serving that kind of religious movement. Nah, nah, no go, no go. Don't, don't trust them. Just, just, just don't do it. it it's, it's not good. I'm hoping there's, there, there's some merchants in Oriel Harbour, now that I'm thinking about it, because if there is, and they are su somewhat sufficiently stocked, we might... What is that noise? Is there another griffin on this goddamn island? I feel like one arch griffin was already pushing it in terms of my capabilities. That's something. I... Don't know exactly what I'm looking at there. It looks like it could be a griffin. But uh it could be a few other things as well. Just, I just need to find an appropriate place to land on this island. There's not many flat bits of beach. It's all rocks. Here? Yeah, we can land here. Well, this looks like it's gonna be fun. Uh, right. Right, what are we, what are we, what are we working with here? Is it a wyvern, actually? It's a basilisk. It's the other one. It's a level 32 basilisk as well. It's a bit mean. If we hit it a few times, that might kill it. Stomp it. Well, it normally does, really. I think hitting most things a few times would probably kill it, but you know, you know what I mean. There we go. Level 32, no problem. No problem at all. Got another, and got another lesser red mutagen as well, which is good. So this was a camp of some sort, I'm guessing. And now... It's not. Now it's definitely not a camp of any description. It is absolutely... wrecked. So... Yeah. Daystar! That's an interesting, uh, interesting name. It's not the most inter interesting of souls to me, but it's... yeah. Nice. Ooh, excuse me. Okay. So I think we'll only have one more marker left, and then it's to, yeah, this island. Which, again, hopefully, we can find some uh, merchants. And maybe some more Gwens. We've not touched Gwen in a while. I feel, and I, and I feel, and I feel. The longer that I, the the longer time that passes without me playing a game of Gwent, the less satisfaction I feel in my life. Because Gwent is just brilliant. Gwent definitely deserves all all the uh, all the praise it gets off the people. Absolutely, it is so fun. 
So, so fun. I do feel like I'm almost at the point now where I'm not going to get many more uh, cards. Like, in terms of, uh, you know, unique cards to win off of, um, off, off of different characters and players. Because I'm very rarely even actually getting cards at all when I when I play people now. It's all it's largely just coin, which I don't really need, obviously. Um, but yeah, like I've not really been even getting like generic cards. Like it's not even like sort of hero cards or anything. It's just all been just, just you know just uh, gold. Not even any generic soldier cards or anything. The two cards which I know that exist that I don't have in my collection, though, is obviously Geralt of Rivia and uh, Roach. Those, those are the two which just haven't appeared at anywhere yet. Well, in terms of uh, in in terms of being able to get them, we've faced them a few times, um, but we've never actually had. Um, We've never actually seen them pop up to, to go into our decks, which is a great shame. Because obviously Geralt, especially, you would just you would want, wouldn't you? You would just want that. Roach is maybe not so good. Like you could probably get a, a free couple of points there if you if you had uh, the Siri card in your deck, which summons Roach. But uh, apart from that, it's not much going on, is there? Right, hopefully we don't pick up anything too heavy here, because if we do, we might have to leave it behind, unfortunately. That's quite good. And hopefully this doesn't have a big old fat gambeson in it. Ah. That's a shame, isn't it? Right, can we... We drop a piece, maybe. Drop the banner be breastplate. Ten point nine one. Yeah, right there we go. We dropped the banner be banner breastplate, which isn't too bad. I think I, I don't think we're going to massively miss that. So we'll get to the uh, dock here in this on this island, and we'll see if we can get any merchants there. Because there's bound, to, there's bound to be at least a general store or a blacksmith or something there, surely. Like, I know it clearly isn't the most important island island in the world, but there's bound to be something there, isn't there? So we'll just fast travel to the harbour. Fast travel to the harbour and let's get onto land. And obviously we can we can meditate for a few hours just to get everyone out and about. It was 420 a.m. is not. Oh oh it's clan clan Twirsack. right. There we go. And there is a blacksmith here, good stuff. It looks like an armorer. Greetings. If you're in need of a weapon, I'd be glad to forge something for you. Thank you, sir. Show them what you have an offer. Let me have it. Have some money. Oh, you don't have that much money. You don't have that much money, which is disappointing. But still. Let's repair. Repair everything that we have equipped, and then we'll just, we'll just repair all the unequipped items as well. Just so we can uh, give them a bit more money to uh, buy stuff off, 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 off of us for. There's still more. Nice, right. So, what can we sell on? Sell the Hindusfial armor. Let's get rid of all this. The, the, the Great Sun armor is going to be a bit tricky to sell, unfortunately. Just because of its mahusive value.
Right, that will do. That is a good bit of uh, stuff sold. Now, what we're really here for, a bit of Gwent. What would you say to a few rounds of Gwent? He's like, no, piss off. I'm, I'm not playing anyone at Gwent. Right. So here we go. It has been a while. Hopefully we remember how to play. He is Nilfgaard. Uh, decoy, nice. We have Siri. Wow, we have Natalis. We have Natalis, Roach, Eilhart, and Siri all in the same hand. We're not gonna get use out of two of those. Clear weather. We don't need. Uh, we draw that as well. Medic, nice. Good stuff. Oh, we should have really redrawn Dandelion, shouldn't we? Because he's useless. He, he doesn't buff anybody. Unless we drew. Unless we do draw a nice card, in which case, yeah. Tibor Eggerblacked. Okay, he's going straight in. Alright. Fair play. Alright, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll decoy, I'll decoy that back. You're looking at my cards, eh? Sneaky bastard. Right, so I'm just gonna pass. Ta ah, he's being a bitch. Right. Lethal of Gullets, okay, right. Imperial Brigade Guard. So if I put the medic in. Him, Shillard. Oh, that's not the best. Gaunter! Go for it, Gaunter. I reckon he's gonna pass. Oh no, he didn't pass. He's gonna pass now, though, isn't he? He's bound to pass now. So we've got a catapult again. Right, it's a trebuchet, sorry. I, I misspoke there. I can use my leader card to wreck the archer, but I'm going to save it for now, I think. Just going to put Dandelion out there. Medic. Oh. This guy's got a good hand, to be fair. Uh, well, we're going to have to start whacking out the heroes now, aren't we? Ah, uh, Natalis. City. Rainfan. Okay. Uh, Isleheart. Pure Brigade, obviously. Right, we shall double our siege. We might win this, you know. I think we're actually we are actually gonna win this. And obviously we'll use our leader card. Yeah, I think we'll probably we've, we've probably got the yeah we've we've won. That uh, that was probably the worst played game of Gwen's I think you'll ever see, but you know what? We won so I'll take it. And we just got 20 crowns, but again, we, we didn't get any special cards or anything. We, we just got that, which is which is fine. It's fine. It's all good. Um. The tower out of nowhere. Is, what is this? What is it? I got a job for you. There's no point standing here in the rain. All right, let's go to mine. We'll talk there. Okay. Sure. I can discuss. So what's the matter? We're still stood out in the rain. You see that node beyond the village? It's just going to say that. We weren't been there for centuries. Till one day we awoke, and bam, there were a tower atop it. That's weird. And all of a sudden lightning started pounding down. As if the Noggle Fair itself was sailing in. Hasn't stopped to this day. That's bizarre. 
Something's got to be done. About the storm. With waves like that, we can't fish nor sail out to raid. Tried entering the tower? You tried getting inside the tower? Have we tried? Very same morning the tower appeared. We went right off. Whole village or near boats. Folk wanted to welcome its owner if he came in peace. Drive him off if he came with ill intent. We knocked and banged, but no one answered. So we opened the door. And that's when our knees turned to jelly. Why? Because beyond that door was something like a sheet of water, but standing upright. Never seen such a thing in my life. Druid said it were magic. Gathered five brave lads, and they all marched in. No sign of them since. I'll look into it. This sounds Fine. bizarre. I'll but... look into the tower. Once you're in, cast your eye around for the folk from our village. Our druid and five good lads. Oh, I'd be a bitter shame to lose them. You have my word. Hemdel, guide you. Enter the tower. This, oh, this sounds interesting. This is a level 30 quest, but we're here, so we might as well do it. Wind whipped and rain battered, Geralt stumbled into a small village on the coast of Anskellig. The foul, uh, the foul weather, he learned, had cursed this spot ever since a mysterious tower appeared one morning out of thin air. As if placed by an invisible giant's hand, intrigued, Geralt decided to investigate. Interesting indeed. We'll uh, talk to this blacksmith first. Hear that noise? That's Freya. Grinding her teeth? <laughs> Means wars are brewing. Time to sharpen our swords. Okay, but and dead, who will lead you? Don't need a kink to stick it to the black ones. No reason to wait. I think I, 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 I think you should be told that you have a queen now. Show me what. But okay. Um. You can't buy that from me, can you? No. Much less devastating. Uh. Do we buy a rune stone off of him? So, you know, if I buy that rune stone off you, and I'll sell you all, all, all this, all these swords, and my lesser rune stones. There we go. That will do. And I can, if I want to play Gwent, but I think. We shall do that in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you all have enjoyed. If you have, then please do like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I shall catch you in the next episode of The Witcher 3. Have a wonderful day, guys. Bye-bye.